first of all, I was born in the middle of the mountains, in the middle of this beautiful mountain, so I want the best customers of all over the world to be here to discuss with me and with my team the next five years in the digital printing business, especially in large format. So this is why we're doing Top of the Mountains. Industry 4.0 IoT, as you can imagine, is one of the, the key elements in that. So I very often get the question, what's it about? And today um, I want to share a little bit of what, uh, what our perspective or my perspective on that is and maybe also bust a couple of myths around that. If you look outside, there are a lot of trends and developments going on in the market. These are some kind of trains, I always say. Some of them you already see, others are still covered up. Some of them are in tunnels and they're waiting to get out into the flashlight. I think it's very good to, to, to look in the future and also to the openness of the company to, to show us what is going to happen in the next years. It, it helps us to think about the new investments for the, for the future. I would like to show you some kind of a word. Cloud, it was based on more than 500 statements out of the study and I think it's quite interesting what are, let's say, the synonyms and the things which popped really up the most. I must say it's very clear how fast the technology is moving and the impact that has got on the competitiveness of the markets, which are becoming increasingly competitive for both the printer and for the machine manufacturer. The biggest problem or the biggest risk of a family business is always the change of generation. We already did it. My role is not being in the operative uh, business. I'm more aspiring partner to Christoph. Christoph has an internal slogan for Durst. We are, and uh, let me say it exactly, yeah. no bullshit company. We did a lot of events, we did a lot of summits, but we were always focused, too front focused, front presentations, not really letting the customer interact with us. Now here, I invited our really best customers from all over the world to speak to us, to interact with us. Yes, this is a new kind of interaction. It has been unseen indoors before, even for my team, it's very new. But I think that's the way to go forward. Peter, to my left, uh, CTO of Durst, he is with Durst more than 15 years. 17. 17, yeah. That's more than 15, I was precise. Peter is a guy you can put out there, give him a Apollo 11 box with a couple of screws, uh, a couple of wires, a couple of machining tools, and he will build you a machine. A lot of customers asked us about single pass, and we have a very clear opinion to this topic. We know single pass is is the future in printing, but not for all width and not for all segments. For example, large format starts upon 1.6 meter and up goes up to 5 meter, and there we do not see single bars as very near in the future. Uh, for it, I'm actually looking forward to the new color coming up, which is the red color. I've been looking for that Coca-Cola red for a long time now. And as you know, China has always been a big market for red because we use it for celebration, for Christmas, even for our weddings as well. Water technology has evolved to a point where it's now a really competitive technology. Starting with 30, 40 square meters a couple of years ago, we have now reached production speeds up to 200 square meters and not just on paper-based substrates, we also managed it to print on polymeric substrates, which is very unique for water technology printing. Well, the roadmap is the most amazing thing I had from Doris so far, because um, I know they're, they're, they're growing, they're getting better, it's the right company to be with and to partnership with, and I feel so confident that I know what's going to happen in the next years. This gave us a perspective of where things are going in the future, and what you know, how technology is changing, and what are the viewpoints of both the customers as well as Durst. So it's very interesting because it was a mix of two different perspectives. Christian is the other part from the service side who implements the service strategies, does the service strategies, and basically tries to bring as much feedback possible from the field he can get. Therefore, a very important man. We want to change from a reaction service to a preventive service. Yeah? 
We implemented in this project uh, several parameters that we can track already and we put the tolerance of these uh, parameters into the system so before the machine gets a breakdown we will see already okay we are in a critical area and we can react. I did appreciate uh, for instance uh, this uh, idea of a platform uh, to um, recover or to get the data uh, from uh, the machine and uh, at Fervalois we know that the, the value is in the flow and we are uh, trying to take care as well of uh, the data, all the data we have in our, our own business, so I think it's a very good thing. The feedback from our customers for today and also yesterday uh, was really excellent. I could not be more happy about it. We're living in a very complex environment to see where the market is going, uh, what the future trends are technologically, also on the material side, on the ink side, was very beneficial to everyone.